Hello and welcome back to Okta's support video series. Today we will show how to set up an enrollment policy for the Okta Identity Engine. This is used to specify what factor is the user allowed to enroll and authenticate with and in what scenario. The option can be found in the security authenticators. The Setup tab will show all the setup factors as well as give the option to add authenticator. The number of available factors to set up will differ based on licensing. In the Enrollment tab, you can see all the enrollment policies and will give the option to set up an enrollment policy and rules in the organization by selecting the Add a Policy option. When setting up an enrollment policy, you will need to specify the policy name, the group that the policy applies to, and the availability of the factors that are set up in your organization between required, optional, or disabled. When setting up a factor as required, the user will be forced to enroll in that factor when the enrollment rule takes effect. When setting up a factor as optional, the user will have the option to enroll in that factor when the enrollment rule takes effect. When setting up a factor as disabled, the user will not be able to enroll in that factor when the enrollment rule takes effect. When setting up an enrollment rule, you must specify the rule's name. If any users are excluded from that rule, the user's IP, where you can specify if the user is from any IP in a network zone or not in a specific zone, as well as selecting all network zones. The rule will take effect when the user is accessing Okta or an application where you can specify if the user is accessing all applications or a specific one, and if the enrollment is allowed or denied. Enrollment policies take effect based on the priority of the policy. So if the user is part of multiple groups that have different enrollment policies, make the new one the highest priority policy to be sure it is the one triggered. Thank you for watching. For more Okta support videos, check out the Okta support playlist right here on the Okta YouTube channel.